She goes on to say, the Negro woman therefore needs the ballot to get back by the wise use of it what the Negro man has lost by the misuse of it. She needs to ransom her race. She carries the burdens of the church and of the school and bears a great deal more than her economic share in the home. In a very short space of time, she has identified key tensions between black men and black women and between blacks and whites. One is that black men do, are not allowed to have the kind of industrial jobs that would provide a wage that can support a family. And black women, therefore, typically need to uh, work outside the home for a wage, which is something that is inimical, is opposite to the idea of the middle class woman who does not engage in wage earning or, or, or really deals with money in any way. Um, so she makes that point, um, but she also says that the, the black woman carries the burden of the church and the school. So then at the same time, she talks about black women have sort of the double duties uh, that are unique to black women but common to women in general, which is um, serving the church, serving the community, making sure that schooling and other services for children are, are there.